In all vertebrate and most invertebrate animals, the brain is the center of the nervous system. Located in the head, usually close to the primary sensory organs, for such senses as vision, hearing, balance, taste and smell, the brain of a vertebrate is the most complex organ of its body. In a typical human, the cerebral cortex, the largest part of the brain, is estimated to contain 50 to 33 billion neurons, each connected by synapses to several thousand other neurons. The word synapse comes from synaptane, which Sir Charles Scott Sherrington and colleagues coined from the Greek syn, together, and haptane, to clasp. Synapses are essential to neuronal function. Neurons are specialized cells whose function is to pass signals to individual target cells, and synapses are the means by which they do so. At a synapse, the plasma membrane of the signal-passing neuron the presynaptic neuron comes into close opposition with the membrane of the target, postsynaptic cell. Both the presynaptic and postsynaptic sites contain extensive arrays of molecular machinery that link the two membranes together and carry out the signaling process. Memories are postulated to be represented by a vastly interconnected networks of synapses of the brain. Researchers have demonstrated that formation of long-term memory in the brain coincides with enhancement in synaptic transmission and the formation of additional synapses between the presynaptic axon terminal and the postsynaptic neuron it synapses with. This phenomenon is called synaptic plasticity and it is one of the most important neurobiological foundations of learning and memory. An essential process in synaptic plasticity is the axonal transport, analogous to shipping goods, this process allows energetic and cellular building supplies necessary for new synapse formation to be carried downstream anterogradely by molecular motors, which then act as cargo porters and continue moving on tracks named microtubule filaments. A protein seems to be the key player in this process. Its name is kinesin. Synthesized in the cell body, members of the kinesin superfamily vary in shape, but the prototypical kinesin is a etherotetramer whose motor subunits, heavy change of KSCs, form a protein dimer that binds two light change KLCs. Kinesin is a protein belonging to a class of motor proteins found in eukaryotic cells. The genomes of mammals encode more than 40 kinesin proteins organized into at least 14 families named Kinesin 1 through Kinesin 14. The heavy chain of Kinesin comprises a globular head, the motor domain, connected via a short flexible neck linker to the stalk that ends in a tail domain, which associates with the light chains. The head is a signature of Kinesin and it has two separate binding sites, one for the microtubule and the other for ATP. Kinesins transport cargoes by walking unidirectionally along microtubule tracks hydrolyzing one molecule of adenosine triphosphate ATP, at each step. Kinesins move along microtubule filaments at a speed of 1.2 micrometers per second. In neurons, the requirements of active transport is highly significant because they are highly polarized and have extensive subcellular domains that have unique functions. So, in neurons, gene products such as proteins or RNAs and organelles such as mitochondria are transported by kinesin transport machinery from the cell body to their subcellular destinations. Kinesin transports several gene products that are important for memory formation, and here we have shown how important kinesins are for long-term memory storage. Thus, we think that kinesin may be a magic bullet for treating disorders of memory and cognition.